Americans across the country are already paying the price of inaction in insurance premiums, state and local taxes, and the costs of rebuilding and disaster relief. So the question is not whether we need to act. The overwhelming judgment of science, of chemistry and physics, and millions of measurements has put all that to rest. 97% of scientists, including, by the way, some who originally disputed the data. I, re I refuse to condemn your generation and future generations to a planet that's beyond fixing. And this is my plan to meet it, a plan to cut carbon pollution, a plan to protect our country from the impacts of climate change, and a plan to lead the world in a coordinated assault on a changing climate. So today, for the sake of our children and the health and safety of all Americans, I'm directing the Environmental Protection Agency to put an end to the limitless dumping of carbon pollution from our power plants and complete new pollution standards for both new and existing power plants. We've got to move beyond partisan politics on this issue. I want to be clear. I am willing to work with anybody, Republicans, Democrats, Independents, Libertarians, Greens, anybody to combat this threat on behalf of our kids. I am open to all sorts of new ideas, maybe better ideas, to make sure that we deal with climate change in a way that promotes jobs and growth. Nobody has a monopoly on what is a very hard problem, but I don't have much patience for anyone who denies that this challenge is real. 